50 Shades of Nude, Dakota Johnson channels the new naked and risque display. The actress is preparing for the release of Fifty Shades Freed, which sees her portray Anastasia Steele for a final time. Having played the lead female role in the erotic romance film trilogy since 2015, Dakota has stripped off on screen many times. So it's hardly surprising the 28-year-old starlet was chosen to feature in Allure magazine's The New Naked Redefining Nude in 2018 issue. Bearing her assets, the cover girl rocked sheer paneled lace lingerie for her starring moment. A post shared by Allure magazine, at Allure, on Jan 16. 2018 at 5 10 a.m. PST. Completing the skin bearing display, Johnson wore a see through slip over the matching set. With her brunette locks styled away from her face, the big screen siren sported large, gold earrings as she stared intensely down the camera lens. In another moment from the photo shoot, Dakota who is said to be dating Coldplay's Christ Martin, 40, appeared to go topless as she sat wth her arms crossed over her chest. Wearing only a clear crystal necklace, the bombshell laid herself bare in the intimate snap. I can still be vulnerable and strong Dakota Johnson giving viewers a glimpse at what makes her tick, the actress revealed she has the phrase lightly, my darling tattooed on her left forearm. Showing their appreciation for the pictures, fans have taken to Instagram to share their reactions. One admirer said of the starlet, she looks so fresh. Elegant and classy. Another wrote, Dakota looks gorgeous. I absolutely love her personality, followed by a red heart emoji. Making reference to the actress on screen love interest, played by Jamie Dornan, 35, one fan commented, Christian Grey. Discussing her involvement in the racy films, Dakota told the magazine what she had gained from the experience. Getting candid, the US beauty admitted, I've learned that I can expose my heart and my emotions and I can still protect myself. I can still be vulnerable and strong. Fifty Shades Freed is set for release February 9.